What's up YouTube and welcome back to my channel Girly Ganja. If you guys are new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. If you're not already following me on my Instagram, make sure you do so at girly.ganja. Today's video, as you can tell by the title, we are going to finally be doing another cooking cannabis video. I know I had one that I did, I did a couple like a year ago and I have had a few of you guys asking me to do some more cooking with the can of butters and oils and things like that. So I wanted to do one today, which I am going to be doing a seafood mukbang. So if you guys wanna see how I made this, then keep on watching. So today I am going to be using this can of butter, which is cannabis infused butter. As you can see, it has a thousand milligrams of THC. And within this whole container, it has a hundred servings per container. So the way that I uh, measured this out was I just cut even as possible um, corners and basically made these triangles that I separated so that I can somewhat know how much is going in to my butter. And I have all my ingredients here. I will also put the ingredients in the description box below. You use a ton of butter, so this is definitely not something that you should be eating every day, and it is not healthy, okay? It is a seafood boil, you know, down south. And um, it also has Coke in it, which is totally optional. That's up to y'all. But again, I will put all the ingredients below in the description box. Once you start cooking it, it is going to look a little chunky. And it, you know, it, it's not going to look like your typical butter and garlic type of sauce. So you literally just cook this down for like 30 to 45 minutes. And that little piece of butter in there is the can of butter. So I put it in there. And once it starts to look like this, you just keep cooking it down and cooking it down. And like I said, it takes about 30 minutes. And then voila, y'all will get this. This is exactly what it will turn into when it's done. It is so chunky and yum. And the seafood, all I did was look up how long it would take for each item to cook. And then I boiled that in water and lemon. And this is just me after all my food was done smoking with the crab. Here is all the foods that I made. I made crawfish, a crab obviously, shrimp, boiled eggs. So far I do not smell the butter at all in the sauce. It don't smell like anything. Like I don't smell the weed. Honestly, there's so many like ingredients in this. I'm sure that it is like drowned in there but it is in there. So let's try it. I have it in a, a smaller bowl so that I'm not just dripping in my big bowl. So this is all the leftovers that I have, which is a lot. So it's a lot of servings. I put like, I think like 13 servings in there. So that's what it is. So I'm going to try it with a shrimp. And I suppose you could like, you could pretty much make, like, mix this butter in anything, really, any ingredients that needs butter. You can use butter, but I also want to try to get into, like, the oils and then start to try to use that with the cooking and see how, um, like, if it makes a difference. So I'm just going to be experimenting. So I figured while I'm experimenting, I might as well, you know, make videos and show you guys me trying to test out this cooking with this butter. Alright John. Here is a little shrimp. It is good though. The sauce is good. But I don't taste the weed. Mm-hmm. Some more of it up in there next time. Mm-hmm. I was thinking too that I should have put more. I was like, I should put like another little like triangle but honestly for me like experiences with edibles I haven't had good experiences so I kind of want to like ease myself into it and not do too much and like use a little bit more next time so next time I'll like up the dosage or something but right now I'm trying to be dying of this crab. Let's 
So good. Let me know if you guys cook with butters and oils. And if you do, do you actually be getting high? Like, I mean, I'm sure people do because obviously if you make like edibles or brownies and things like that, you get high off of that. But I'm just curious like how and what the effects will be if you're making it like in your actual food, like in a meal. Like this is a meal. It's not just like a brownie that you can eat and then wait. So I'm excited to see like how, you know, experimenting with it goes. But it's good. It basically tastes the same as, you know, the normal sauce usually does. I don't taste the weed. But it's good. So yeah. Let me know if y'all ever made this sauce. If y'all haven't made this sauce, it's it's probably like one of the best sauce to make. I haven't... I haven't had a chance to buy the real sauce packet. Every time I go on Amazon to buy it, it's always sold out. So I've never um, actually got a chance to try the real sauce. But I'm going to buy it one day and see if it tastes anything like the one that I've been making. But she has a ton of videos showing how to make this sauce. So if you guys want to know exactly how to make it, since I didn't show that, if you guys just search Be Love like Making Sauce, it'll literally come up and she shows you and tells you how to make the sauce. So... It's good though. You like the sauce? Mm -hmm. See you in better with La 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 bum bum. Where is the wheat? The summer table. La 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 la. Oh, look at these sheet. I love seafood. I could eat seafood all the time yo I sure could mm, I gotta eat an egg y'all eat eggs watch this y'all it goes down mm. I lit it on the stove. I don't know who created mukbangs, but this is a perfect one. But ooh, the way it skipped me, skipped me, skipped me. I'm about to eat up my last crab leg, which are, and then I'm gonna smoke this weed. This is good though. This could be dangerous. Growing with weed can be dangerous. Because if you put too much and then you go in on this stuff and you eat this like I'm eating it, you might get your ass high. What you think, man? It's good. Yeah, you hung up. <laughs> I was yeah. gonna see if you would have passed it to me with my dirty hand. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you guys liked it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Um, let me know if what kind of food you guys would like to see me cooking. If you guys want to see more cooking with cannabis videos. Um, and yeah. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys on the next upload. California love. California knows how to party. California knows how to party in the city